got no more wine. Kiri, uh, save me a bottle of wine. Bring me a bottle of wine. But wine, Kiri, wine. I need some wine. Because this is the wine cooler. I've got a small amount of the wine cooler left. Let me tell you what it is, because this is really good. This is a wine cooler that can go on a tabletop quite easily, like I've just put here. Um, it's got a magnetic door on the front, and inside here it can take six bottles of wine very easily. Comes with uh, alternative shelves to put anything else in there that you'd want to as well. Um, but six bottles of wine that I'll pop in there in just a second. On the bottom of this, uh, you've got a temperature control. You've also got a light button in there as well. Temperature up and down, so you could have red wine in there and have it at the right temperature, and you could have white wine in there and have it at the right temperature power button and away you go uh, stick it in Kerry stick it in um, so this for summer a brilliant idea and uh, what we're putting in there Ooh, is it the Semillon nice. Chardonnay yeah. Lovely. Um, now, you can put champagne in this quite easily. Kiri and I will often have a, a night where we just uh, sip champagne, have chips and mayonnaise. Yes, we're posh. Um, you can put your cans in there. There's a friend of mine, oh, I, I hate to gossip, friend of mine, Zach, he just drinks um, stout and eats scotch eggs. I, I have to tell you now, the wind is appalling. Anyway, uh, he'd pop that in here. Up to you what you want to use for it, but stick your wine in. When you first get it, plug it in. It'll take about three hours to get to its optimum cooling temperature. Uh, this is an environmentally friendly one as well but it's on a different phone number to the numbers we normally do so if you do want to get this you have to dial specifically the number that's flashing now and it's that number there 0904 251 2003 0904 251 2003 so if you do want to get this you ring up you press one on your telephone keypad and you've bought a wine cooler haven't you always wanted one because you could use this for all sorts of different things i mean we're selling it as a wine cooler because we've happened to put the wine cooler shelves in it, right? But you could have this as a fridge in the office. You could have this as a fridge in the bedroom. You could have this as your fridge if you want. I mean, it's a cooler and it's about optimum temperature of bottles, but for what bottles? Well, any bottle you could care to mention. Uh, the fact that you could use this for red wine makes it a specialist cooler, you see, which is why we've put it in the wine half hour, because it is a wine cellar cooler, if you like, because you can set it to room temperature for red wines. Do you ever want to just chill uh, a red wine slightly well very possibly certain red wines benefit from just a little chilling it will do that rosés of course you're going to put them in here champagnes of course you're going to put them in here this is where it comes in handy father's day is less than a couple of weeks away he'll love this that is a dad's gadget isn't it that is a dad's present and we'll deliver it in time for Father's Day. All you need to do is have a look at the price. Just 31 quid we're talking about now. You've got a chance to get it if you dial 0904 251 2003 and press 1 on your telephone keypad. It's an SWS six bottle wine cooler available now at 30.99. Last couple on the table. Uh, the next 40 people to ring me get it, but these are starting to go in front of you now, so if you want to get it, you must ring now. Now it's buying time. If you can see yourself with this, then ring the number at the top of the screen. That's specific to this. Pop your wine in it. Did you get the um did you get the semi-on semi Chardonnay? That's what we popped in there. That chilled. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? If you got that, do you want a wine cooler to go with it? Oh, I'm like the devil, aren't I? Tempting you. Look at the temptation. Look at me, my horns are showing. There's more, right? There's more, right? I've got bar stools coming up. And these are the bar stools I've got in my own house. I've got them around my breakfast bar. Oh! <laughs> They're dead good. When you have people round, it's brilliant. Not only do I sit and have my cornflakes and my porridge and stuff, well, me and Kiri both, but, um, you know, occasionally she stops the night. I don't want to get into it now, though, because I'm busy. But, um, yeah. uh, but when people come round, it's very social. Bar stools coming up in a second. Uh, this is the wine cooler available. Let me front door open. Let me shut it. There we are. Uh, wine cooler available now. You were looking inside there, weren't you? Awfully sorry. Let me open it up again. That helps, doesn't it? Sorry about that. You, you were looking in, and then I just cocked it all up. John in Aberdeen. Oh, Miss Great Britain's from Aberdeen. That happened last week. That happened last week. Kiri's just asked how I know. How do I know where Miss Great Britain's from? Uh, let me think. Um, <laughs> I, there's certain current affairs that I like to keep abreast of, do you know what I mean? Um, Robert, thanks very much. Don't make your own jokes up. Uh, Colin in Preston. <laughs> Colin in Preston. It's funny. This kind of telly is funny, isn't it? You're flicking around on a Sunday night, as you do. Uh, there's nothing on. I mean, it's tosh. At this time of night, isn't it? Telly is rubbish, isn't it? Right? And you're flicking around for something. The thing about us is you can keep coming back to us because we're live. You never know what could happen. Um, I mean, last week, Kiri, at this point, completely naked. Um, we'll rerun that in a bit. Um, 
29, you might want to stick around for it, I don't know. 20, or was she? Mm. I'm having fun tonight, I don't normally have fun because I'm a right miserable old, oh, this is good stuff, this. I wish I'd got some of that. Oh, have you got that ring on, Kiri? Right, in a minute we'll come to you. Let me tell you uh, that this is on a different phone number to our normal number, and a lot of people are trying to get it on a totally different phone number. Four people have ordered taxis, six have got a margarita pizza. So have a read of that, 0904 <laughs> 251 2000. Two rang the Samaritans, they weren't happy. They're very busy people, don't do that. 0904 251 2003. Three. You don't get a three on the end. Messed the whole thing up, Kevin, in your bill. But you did the right thing. You got it. Twenty-seven ninety-nine now. Um, special Kiri, don't wink at me like that. It's very flirtatious. Um, tell <laughs> me about lucky. your ring. <laughs> I've got one and a half carats of diamond ring that you can see here. There's only four of them, and they are the champagne colour diamonds. I know. I said there's only four of these. Four. Yes, I said four. They're coming up after our bar stools. So if you want this, there's only four. Four? This up. Yep, four. <laughs> okay. Um, right, those, those in the next ten minutes, then the bar stools next. Um, well done, Marlies, in East Mosley. I've got two phone lines left. Two phone lines left. Okay, time is running out. Mary in Leeds is in. Um, we we'll better stop the music. Pressure's on you, not me. Here we go. Two phone lines left. Who's going to get it? The wine cooler. Uh, great Father's Day present. Here come those lines. Over to you. So coming up next, breakfast bar stools, bar stools, hydraulic pumpy stools. What's next? 